to explain you this poem of section C. The name of the poem is The Little Things and Sadastic the Class. Now, the name is itself The Little Things. means little things in our life that we are not observing, we do not think of, but they are very much important. They keep a lot of importance and play a significant role in our lives. So let's take a look what are there. Little drops of water, little grains of sand means have you ever seen the drops of water, how tiny they are? Sometimes they also look beautiful, but when they are gathered together, they make a waterfall or they make a fountain in this way. The little grains of sand. Now, little grains of sand means, have you seen sand? If you take sand in your hand, you can see the grains of sand. It means it is not something like this. It is gathered together. It is just small particles gathered together in that way. Make the mighty ocean and the pleasant land. Now, the little drops of water, when they are single, they are just drops of water, but when they are gathered together, they create a huge monster ocean. In the same way, when the drops, when the grains of sand, when they are just uh, flying in the air, they do not keep any importance. They are not significant at all. But when they are gathered together, they form a huge gigantic land. And the pleasant land. So the little errors led the soul away from the path. So in this way, when you are going to the correct path, when you are doing something right, why you have to get distracted listening to others when who all are misguiding you? Means all the sorrows in your life, whatever, if the errors are coming, errors are there in everybody's life. But when you are going on the right track, when you are talking about something right, why you have to worry about wrong things. You should always walk ahead. You should always think about what's the next instead of stopping because of errors. Because here we have already been told and it's a very good example given by the author that little drops of water. Really, when anything is single, it is not powerful. But when it is gathered, when it is in abundance, it becomes very powerful. Just like a stick. When the stick is single, it can be broken. But when it is in a group, when it is in a bunch, then it cannot be broken. It's not easy to break it. In the same way, when we are alone, it is easy for someone to attack on us, to put us down, to put us low. But when we are in a family, when we are together, when we are having a group of people helping us, then it's not easy for anyone to put us down, to put us low, or break us down. I hope you like this poem. Thank you so much.